Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting really to episode 105 of My Hero Academia. So it's gonna get started in three, two, one, go. So close, but so far away. God damn it! Once again, ha! Huh. I just like excuse me. Seriously? Oh, God, it felt like forever. Hmm? Why is it still a briefcase? <laughs> well, I mean, boys, at least you tried. <laughs>
like it, baby. actually be a family with him. Oh, God, they're not going to show this. I don't want to see this again. Which means you can make a new and start over with your son. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, but we just forgetting one little thing. Like, mm. <laughs> you know, <laughs> just that one little thing. It's gonna take a long fucking time. Because there is no right answer. Well, really, there is no wrong answer.
Shit. <laughs> yeah, but waking up at six AM, oh my God. Don't worry, you will. Mm hmm. Because she was the first one to forgive you. Just <laughs> <laughs>
looks so good. Oh my god. It's making me hungry. I haven't eaten yet. God damn it. <sighs> he might not ever be able to do it. But see, she didn't say, oh, damn.
you just have to make that first step, whether it's you or your father. It's kind of the same with us. got a long way to go but still <laughs> oh. mm. cause yeah he's not there mm. there's so many other things I want to say but I think you know with, with this I, I'm gonna wait until the final episode because there, there's still a lot I want to say especially with how the show is doing certain things and everything and I don't want to put it in like a 30 minute video I think once again I am going to wait until the final episode and probably that video will mainly probably be 45 minutes and I think I'm gonna wake up early specifically for that episode and I think that's when I am really going to tell all about how I feel and ish with this season and how this season was done but it was a good episode I mean yes like to have Fuyumi be the one to automatically forgive him first, but you have two sons, one Yasuyu abused, the other one who found out everything, you know, just later, and how Natsuyu is still hesitant to start a relationship with his father. I mean, yes, it, it, same thing if someone, oh, wait, wait, wait. Who is that, though? See, now the question is, is that supposed to be... Okay, then that has to be in the manga. Okay, 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 okay. Because, like, for a moment, seeing this villain, I was thinking, I was like, okay, is this going to be filler now and such? But, like, okay. The fact that Yumi was the first one to forgive him and such, it, it's fine. You, you know, you, us as women, like, we, we can easily forgive someone even though they've wronged us, whether it's, like, um, anything in a relationship. When it's guys, it takes a little bit longer. And then also sometimes with certain females, it also takes a little longer. It depends on what it is. But he, Endeavor has broken his family so fucking much to the point where, yes, Natsu can't be around him. And neither really, Shoto he can. He's starting to warm up to him. But it's just, there's still something there, of course, you know can't really talk about that yet but the, just that little chip on the wall and everything we knocking it down a little bit by bit but it's coming and I'm guessing with that situation of that character um the situation of, to of Toya because I barely really know much about him I, I do know the big thing but not really like his backstory and everything and what all happened to him to for him to become insert person's name here um so i i do hope we get to learn that soon i'm guessing we're not going to learn about that till at least season seven maybe i don't know because god because mm -hmm. <laughs> i want to know it's so damn bad and I want to see it so damn bad because I didn't read that that chapter about him, but 
the day when that chapter came out, I did see it all over Twitter. And of course, that day when we all found out about that ish, I was so fucking happy that I was right about that shit because something about it and about that character was just off to me ever since I saw that character for the first time. And I was like, yeah, you might be insert this person here and such. But uh, something tells me by next week, Natsu is going to forgive his father. He's going to take that first step or that first direction with his father to have a better relationship only for it to probably between season six and season seven crumble down because of insert person's name here and the secrets that insert character's name here knows that we can't really talk about yet but yeah I mean it was like it was interesting to just have them all sit down and even though yes Natsu couldn't be there as long it was nice it was really nice to see them as a family but at the same time where he has this dream of not having Toya there yeah it is off-putting because he isn't here and you feel bad you feel even worse that you know yeah not everybody in your family is here also with Todoroki's mom like yes the fact is like if she does good she's gonna be able to get discharged yes and she wants to live with her family again she didn't say anything about her husband so it concerns me when she sees her husband for the first time in how many of her years it's been, will she be able to muster the courage and the strength to be able to live around him, to sleep in the same bed as him? And this is that and the third without him, you know, possibly going back to his abusive past. And it's like, it, this is so many unanswered questions that we possibly won't know until season six or season seven but other than that guys that is my reaction review towards episode 105 of my hero academia if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially y'all next saturday for episode 106 bye guys